So, ever since Activision's contract with Bungie ended, a lot of people in the gaming community weren't too sure about what the future holds for Bungie and their Destiny franchise. Well, today, I just have to say the Destiny franchise is bright and the future is just so beautiful. We learned that Bungie is going the full MMO route to really embrace that genre title. In the future of the game, they will allow you to customize almost everything in Destiny 2. And of course, this will be including perks and randomly rolled stats. There will also be transmogs so you can keep certain looks on certain armor pieces while still keeping and maintaining those stats. Abilities and powers will evolve. You will have finishers in the game in different movesets that can be customized on each character and each subclass. As part of the evolving world of Destiny, there are new features coming to Destiny which is going to be called Destiny New Light. This will let you experience the entirety of the Destiny journey from any point in the very beginning of the Destiny franchise. This will include Destiny 1, Destiny 2, and all the expansions. This new light medium will also be free to play for anyone who has access to a PC and would like to play it. So Destiny will have a free to play option for the entire franchise. They also announced that there will be cross saves so you can easily play your characters across all platforms. And with the Google Stadia medium involved, you will also be able to play Destiny 2 anywhere in the world on any single platform. In terms of future of independent publishing, Destiny 2 will also be moving from Battle.net and be transferring everybody over to Steam in fall of 2019. A lot of people love Steam so this is a great move and there will be no more exclusives either. With this route, Bungie is really going to be crushing a lot of free to play titles out there. They are currently the biggest indie studio in the world and with more than 2 million players that play Destiny and Destiny 2 daily, the game is about to become bigger than a lot of free to play games out there and with the free to play options is going to be even crazier. So as someone who currently owns Destiny 2 and all the expansions in the yearly pass, I know a lot of people were a little bit sad about this because they paid money for things. However, I look at it in such a way where I'm thinking about it this way, Activision were the ones who really got most of that money at that point in time. This time, this is a new leaf for Bungie, and I'm really embracing what they're trying to do right now. I'm really excited to see new Guardians hop into the game with us, free to play, it doesn't even matter what it is. I like to see that in the game, and if you decided to purchase the game with the latest expansion, it will only be $35 instead of 60 bucks. That is a really great deal. So Bungie is full steam ahead with the turnaround and I'm really loving this. With the free to play options in play, will you jump into Destiny 2? Will you try it out? Will you try out the Destiny Light that is coming to Steam? Because I know a lot of people are like, uh, you know what, I don't like Destiny, I don't like this, I don't like that but it's going to be free, so I would like to know what you guys think about this. Now, I know some people hold allegiances to certain games. Personally, I don't, it's just a game. And that is why I tend to see things from a different perspective a lot of times. This is a great change, not just for Destiny and the entire community, but mostly for the industry itself, because Bungie is setting the standard for a lot of AAA titles out there. So let me know what you guys think about this. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.